Hi, I'm Chase Thompson Baugh with Simply Mac in Salt Lake City. Now, some people have complained about not being able to use MKV files inside of the Apple TV. And in fact, files coming out of the application MKV tools don't work in the Apple TV at all. Well, I'm going to show you why and how you can get around that. So here on the computer, you can see here we have iTunes open. And if we come here to movies, we have a couple of video files in here. Now, all these video files, if I were to click on them and uh, do a command I, and what that does is that gets me information about whatever I'm selected, I'm going to come here and I'm going to see that this type of video is called an MPEG-4 video file. Now, typically that's with the extension MP4. So at the end of the video, whatever it's titled, it shows up as dot mp4 or even sometimes as m4v now what that is is that's an mpeg4 video file it's very good for streaming video it's very good quality and uh you know for both video and audio um, but there's another type of video file out there that ends in a dot mkv and that type of file is actually really common in most circles where that file can be very robust it can have lots of video streams lots of audio streams and subtitle streams but it's also very small. It uses similar technology as the M uh, M4Vs and MP4s, but it contains it a little bit better. Now, the problem with these types of files, iTunes doesn't know what to do with them. iTunes can't play them. And if iTunes can't play them, we can't get them over to our Apple TV. So what do we do? If you're using applications like MKV tools, it's just going to spit out MKVs, but that can't be used in the Apple TV. So what are we going to do here? Well. If you'd like to know any more about MKV before we move on, you can go ahead and do a quick Google search or go to Wikipedia, type in the letters MKV, and you'll pull up this article, and you can learn a little bit more about that. But we're not going to cover that right now. We're going to cover about MKV tools. Now, the creators of MKV tools uh, have made this project open to anybody who wants it, which means that it's freely available. You can go download it for yourself. And just like I said, a quick Google search of MKV tools will pull up the right thing. But they've kind of realized that MKV tools was not quite as versatile as it needed to be. So they split up the project into three different projects. You have AVI tools, MP4 tools, and MKV tools. So if you're looking for something that you can use to convert videos to put on the Apple TV, don't choose MKV tools at this point. Go ahead and choose MP4 tools or you can choose my preferred encoder, which is Handbrake. And Handbrake is actually very versatile and in my opinion does a little bit better job. You can find that by a quick Google search of Handbrake as well. It's Mac and PC compatible, so everybody can use it. So if you're using MKV tools, that's why you can't get it to work with the Apple TV, is because iTunes doesn't know what to do with it. So use a better tool like Handbrake or MP4 tools.